I'm good at vamping, right? Kidding, I'm terrible at vamping. Hello, everybody. Welcome. Welcome. To something I've never done before. We're gonna kind of build a PC on stream. And I say kind of because, like, it's pretty much, like, mostly built already. Oh, I can check my headphones. Woo! It's almost time. I, I've got the Geek Squad warranty on these bad boys, these Steel Series, because I love them so much. And uh, when I when I got the Best Buy warranty, the the guy told me, he just straight up told me like, hey, if you break these, like you know, the day before the warranty's up, if like something happens and they get smashed, the day before the warranty's up, you can come in and we'll give you what they're worth or a new pair. So when, Very, so when is the warranty up? Hi, by the way, I'm here. Just because. oh yeah, Ryan's here. Um, in August. All right, so invite now. me over. <clears throat> well, no, they're, they're already cracking. Like so. I'll take okay. Off real quick. So, in August, invite me over. <laughs> so, right. It, here, there's that nice little crack, and it's getting worse. Um, I just put them on, and I felt something like snap. Oh, ooh. Yeah, ooh. keep playing with it. Ooh, this might be a I'm trading these in this weekend kind of thing. Ooh. Yeah, that might need to get uh, swapped out before Extra Life. F. That does not feel. It's free. I just bring it in. I'm gonna give me a new pair. I'm actually very hot. I'm gonna take this off. <sighs> Welcome to the gun show. Featuring itty bitty little guns. How you doing, Ryan? Alright. How was work today? Did you have a good time uh, at school? Mm. What'd you learn? I wish, it, I wish I was at home. That's fair. I kicked butt today. At work. Just did a lot of shit. Um, okay, let's get started. Um, so yes, I am building a stream. I'm building my stream PC right now. Um, this project has kind of been in the works for, um, I'd say like a couple months now. When, when did you give me the capture card, Ryan? Um. Or when did we maybe talk about that? I don't know when we talked about it, but I definitely gave you like the last time I was over. Yeah, that was like a or th ago. that or when you moved in. I'm not entirely sure. I've been meaning to build a street PC for a while now, though. Um, just haven't had the parts and stuff like that, and I'll explain kind of more of the logistical battle of that and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, so let's uh, let's let's show off the computer I'm gonna be using. <sighs> it's a real. 
it looks really good. Hey, Harry, the the computer I'm going to be using, the case, it looks like really professional. Um, it's just a, yeah, that's it. It doesn't even have a front panel or anything. Like it's missing its IO panel entirely. Um, <laughs> um, What's an IO panel? It's the panel with all the like buttons and stuff on the front. Um, yeah, the, the room's very bright. Um, it's not just some cave, it's an actual room. This actually was the master bedroom for the previous owner. Um, why? I don't know. There's like a billion windows. Um, but yeah, so this is the PC. And let me kind of show you. Essentially, this is, this is a PC I took from work. It was going to be recycled, so I, I ripped out the motherboard and the hard drive and everything. And so I just took the case and the power supply unit, essentially. Um, take the webcam. Yeah. Let me show you around. Look at that. Gonna... Hold on, let's see the fish first. Hi, fish. Fish tank. Okay. Anyways, so this is the innards um, power supply here. This motherboard, it's a Asus Prime H720M Plus. Um, I don't know what the plus means. Um, we've got 16, I believe, gigs of RAM. Um, if you can focus. Focus, you bitch. Anyways. Um, Cooler Master, CPU Cooler Master. Um, cooling an i5 processor. Um, the, you, you can really tell that this motherboard and this case are not compatible because, uh, yeah, it, it sticks up. Um, this case will never be closed. Um, <laughs> um, ghetto rigging! Which, oh, oh, it gets better, Ryan. It gets better. It gets more ghetto. Um, so essentially, because there's incompatibilities, um, this cord, which is the power button, essentially. Um, this cord, which is the power button, it doesn't plug in anywhere on the motherboard. They're just incompatible, which means the power button does not work. Um, this, this is one of the first hurdles I had to overcome. I spent so long trying to figure out how to turn this on. Like I was looking over forums and stuff. And a lot of forums were like, oh, most motherboards have like a hard power button, stuff like that. Um, this one doesn't. What it does have though is its power pins, which are, this is weird. Uh, where are the power pins? Ba, 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 ba. These guys, these guys right here, the set of pins. I'm gonna move, move my hand so you can see it in the light. There we go. They're right there. This camera's not great for this kind of stuff, but these pins right here, essentially, they control the functions of the front um, panels, things like reset buttons, power buttons, stuff like that. Um, essentially, you can you can jump the computer with any metallic object, say like a screwdriver. Um, so until I buy some, then Amazon sells power switches that you just plug in, just adds an external button. And until I just get that, I'm going to be using a power, using a screwdriver to turn it on and off. Um, what? You can do whatever you want. Okay. Um, <laughs> but yeah, what else about this thing? Came with a case fan. That works. It's nice. Um, but yeah, pretty, pretty, pretty freaking bare bones. Um, <clears throat> I tested some of these settings. Here we go. All right. So there's a couple things I needed though, and we need to still put in this computer. So obviously I couldn't take a hard drive from work because, you know, data sensitivity and stuff like that. Um, come on. There we go. Oh, perfect. Because data sensitivity and stuff like that. So I had to actually buy um, a hard drive. So let's put that in first. Um, where'd I put that? <clears throat> so I'm going to be using a Crucial MX500. It's a one terabyte solid state drive. I went with one terabyte because fuck you. <laughs> I mean, that's fair. <laughs> the, the, it was like $20 more expensive than like the 500 gig one. So like yeah yeah I would uh, <laughs> definitely show up more yeah I was standing at Best Buy and I was like I was about to ask the guy for the 500 and then I'm like well, I'm gonna I'm gonna beat myself up later for this 
if I don't get the, um, just a slightly bigger one. <clears throat> You've never seen a solid state drive? They're really boring looking. There's like a little, a little brick. And they're nice for this kind of use because I don't have anywhere to actually mount it in the PC. But, so, <clears throat> the difference between a solid state drive and a traditional drive is that a traditional hard drive has spinning plates inside of it that pretty much are magnetized and stuff like that. And the little needle goes back and forth and reads it. It's technically analog, um, I think. Um, this is completely digital. There are no moving parts in here. So, in other words, you can literally, like, you can duct tape this thing to any surface on your PC and it's fine. That's the, the cool thing about it. Um, so, right here, this little guy, he's connected to the power, he's connected to the power supply unit, so he's gonna power our solid state drive. So I'm gonna plug him in. Learning computers with Kev. Yay. Okay. And then, um, it needs to be able to talk to the computer. So that's what this is for. This is called a SATA cable. Um, it's got two ends. You, there, one end's usually bent, like in a 90 degree angle, like that. Like, like that. Doesn't matter which end you plug in, but one end goes into the hard drive. Oh, and if, if anyone's ever using this for a guide, first off, stop. This is a terrible guide. But in... Inside, there's like a little like L bend. You can see it on this side, like right here by my finger that's moving right now. There's a little like L cut out. Essentially, that's gonna match to the same shape on your um, on your hard drive. So, yeah, it plugs in like this. Ta-da! And then the other end, ugh, get out of there, like. And I got hugged into this thing. I don't know what the fuck that thing is. This is also a Dell prefab, so it, it's got a lot of, like, weird little, like, things. Um, that being said, Dells are actually very nice. Dells are very upgradable. Um, so I'm actually very happy I got a Dell. Um, hello from the other side, you know. If I can just reach in there. There we go. Okay. We're in the motherboard now. And I'm going to try to tuck this guy in there. Like I said, it shouldn't matter too much because it's not moving. Actually, what I want to do is I want to... Actually, unplug you. So my sister got an Alienware through Dell. Is that like, like the same thing? or? Yeah, Alienware is just Dell's brand. Okay. So in theory, that should also be super upgradable as well when needed, right? I don't, I don't know as much about the Alienware brand. If I had okay. to guess, probably. I mean, Dell's entire claim to fame when they first started was that they essentially um, they were very cost efficient because Dell did not make computers until they were ordered. So essentially, they didn't have like a big backlog of computers. Which in today's day and age doesn't seem very smart. But. It is what it is. I mean, back in the back in those days when like, you know, not everyone had or needed computers yet. It was very smart. Because, you know, they didn't just have a bunch of inventory just sitting around. Yeah. Potentially getting outdated and shit. Yeah, exactly. <clears throat> so he's tucked away in there now. Um, I'm not going to move it because, well, I guess I can just tilt this. He's tucked away in there. Safe and sound. He's snug. Um, let me just take a break real quick. <sighs> what else would you drink when you're building a computer? Mountain Dew. Um, so that's the hard drive installed. Woohoo, we did it. <clears throat> so, second thing is 
I I have a lot of peripherals. So, and the, I mean, I guess these next two parts are kind of hand in hand. Um, this is a two PC setup. Two PC setups are very common on the internet and on Twitch. A lot of people have them just because essentially what they essentially do is they make it so that this computer, this processor is going to be handling the the streaming, the uploading, stuff like that, the, the encoding, um, which is awesome because it frees up my computer, the gaming computer, to then have more processing power for the games. And so the two of them together make a nicer looking stream. They make it run smoother and they make my games run smoother too. Um... But with that comes the problem of I now have to figure out how to run all my equipment. Um, so I'm going to have to figure some of that stuff out kind of on the fly as we go here. Um, but one of the things is that this, this, this motherboard by itself does not have a whole lot of USB ports. Um, so, purchase number two! USB 3.0 PCI card. This was actually stupid cheap on Amazon. This was like, I don't know. It was really cheap. I want to say it was like 20 bucks. Oh, uh, I was going to guess lower. Yeah. It might have been said like stupid. You said stupid cheap, so I'm just like, oh, five bucks. It might have been like 15 or something. No, I am a little afraid. Um, there's a disc in here in the box. My This does not have a disk drive. Um, so... If it requires, like, the disc to upgrade software and stuff, um, I'll have to figure that out, but whatever. Um, okay. Hey, I know a guy who's got, like, two disc drives that's not that's just I've, sitting I mean, around. I've, I've got one on my other computer. I'll just have to burn the, burn it to a USB, which I'm doing right now, actually. I'm, built, I'm burning Windows to a USB right now. Um, but, yeah. So, this card, pretty cool. Um, it adds five USB slots in, uh, in externally, and this one actually adds two internally. So I'm assuming, and another thing too, oh, that's for power. Um, so that means I think that if I wanted to like, you know, put like a, a USB um, external hard drive just permanently in my case, I could. Um, I don't know why, um, but options. Okay, so. I'm gonna, where is it? It's over here. How do I show this off better? Huh. Nope. Okay, well, anyways, there's this wonky donkey thing that kind of protects some of these ports, but it's all upgradable. So you see here, there are these four slats. They're, they're, they're really slats, like these come out. Um, and essentially, they're for upgrading things, like putting extra equipment in. So there's this little blue latch on the inside, and this is all going to be different, just depending on your PC case. This is how this Dell just does it, but there's this blue latchy guy i think if i just if i push or pull on it i think if i push in yep then this entire thing like a door opens up yeah that's kind of cool um i don't know which one's gonna line up with actually was it gonna line up yeah it should line up I'm going to take out this one. Just slip it out. See, it just comes out. And now we've got this opening. And we're just going to take our card. And there are some pins on the bottom that match up to pins on the board. Not pins, but like slots. And then it should just, hopefully... I can actually see what I'm doing. Hold on. There we go. Okay. Whew, I was a little worried there for a second. <laughs> um, but yeah, so it just sits in there. Um, and it comes with some screwdriver, some screws. So we can actually screw it in place. So I'm gonna do that now. This is a very riveting stream. Where's my bag? There it is. Actually. Actually. Oh shit, it's not on. 
I use this one. Chris actually got this for me forever ago. Hey, drone. This is a, it's an Asus Prime H270M. It's old. <laughs> this is actually, it's all leftover, not leftover, but it's all, essentially this is all the stuff I've upgraded from my gaming PC that I'm just kind of repurposing in the stream PC. That's kind of what you're looking at now. Oh, that's great. Where the hell's the actual screwdriver? Oh, yeah, that might be a problem. Um, so because it's a stream PC, there's actually going to be no graphics card. Uh, the CPU, I believe, is an i5. I want to say like 8800K. Well, I don't know where the screwdriver went. God damn it. Hold on. So that's fun. But the, uh, no, no GPU because the CPU has a built-in graphics card driver, which for my, for streaming purposes should be fine. Again, I mean, I'm half winging this right now. So we'll see. I mean, it booted and I could see, uh, I got to BIOS earlier. So that's a good sign. Son of a bitch. Come on, just bite the screw. You can do it. Come on. Are there different size screws? Do they give me different size screws? I feel like that'll all be the same, but why the hell would they give me four? What kind of What kind of freaking uh, operation they run in here? Oh, I could use the I could use the slat I took out from this computer on my gaming one. Thank goodness. I wonder if it doesn't even need to screw. And that's like the purpose of the whole door thing. Let's see. So it's in there. But let me see something quick here. Yeah, I mean that that's not going anywhere. Whoops. That's why there's this door thing, I guess. So you don't need screws, because yeah, it's it's pretty in there. So let me kinda let me take you in for a closer look. Huh. Oh, upside down. There we go. So this is kind of what we're dealing with. So you can see the two internal USBs, which again is kind of weird, but kind of cool, I guess. Um, but it needs power. Um, and so I actually did some of this work ahead of time um, because I was a little afraid of this, but essentially it came with this guy, this like weird extension thing. And I'm so glad it did because otherwise this would not have been able to reach. There would just be no way. Um, so luckily it did come with it and I can literally just maybe plug it in. <laughs> sure yeah and uh, it goes oh god hold on you don't need to see this part you just be plugging it in there's nothing exciting about this <laughs> uh yeah i know i mean so the whole thing is that like i'll be able to either get it from the internet because i'll be able to get to the internet but my, my stream piece, my gaming PC has a USB drive, or like a, a disc. So I'll be able to use that no matter what. Hey! Vextus, aka Steve, thank you so much for the resub. 23 months, pogs, champing. Thank you so much. 
Okay. Um, let me plug in that power actually. Pog champ. Okay, you're my little pog champ. Come here. Come here. <laughs> And I've actually got a, uh, I've got another one of these USB expansions on my gaming PC. I just, I really didn't want to rip it out. What's all new in the PC? Mostly old stuff. Um, it's all like stuff I've upgraded from my other PC. Then it's gonna see if I can use it as a stream PC. And then last bit. But uh Elgato HD60 Pro capture card. HDMI is very nice. Probably RGB strips. Yeah. Yeah, I mean if you had a hard drive, like an external hard drive that you were just like, I wanna seal this away. Um but like motherboards come with so many SATA ports. Why would you ever need a USB port on the inside? For that purpose at least. Um See, so yeah, I mean, same um, with our capture card, same thing. We're going to be removing one of our little slats and just putting it into the motherboard. Yeah. Um, the SSD was a, it's a Crucial MX500. One terabyte. I like how the question was what S. I mean, maybe you saw the SSD. It's back here already. But like, who would install a regular hard drive these days, right? Yeah. Once again, I think I need to stand up for this. There we go. And luckily the Elgato does not need PCI power, so we just we just close this little door, lock them in place. They're in there now. <laughs> in there forever. <laughs> you live there now. You download Chrome. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> oh god. Just default to SSD? I mean yeah. Uh, that's a good question. I don't think so. Do you mean like an M2 slot? Oh, wait. Is that an M2 slot? Oh, wait. Double checking. Is that you, Kelso? Yeah, M2. Yeah, it actually does have an M2 slot. Huh. Wish I would've known that. Oh, well. Yeah, okay. That's what I thought. I was like, at first I was like, who's this guy? And then, like, the more I was talking to him, I'm like, oh, that's right. Your name's not the same on Twitch anymore. Uh... All right, and I think that's that's pretty much it. Um, but as I was saying, my name is a song band called Archspire. Hmm. Okay. Um, as I was saying, my setup's a little unique because I have a two PC setup already by default, like with my gaming PC, because I also capture Chris's PC all the time, um, which kind of brought up another unique issue is do i need two capture cards now if i'm gonna keep doing the same thing and uh yes is the short answer um so it's kind of like well god damn now i gotta buy another capture card unless you have an awesome friend um ryan so graciously donated his capture card because i wasn't using it yeah and so but uh it's an external elgato capture card 
Um, all the research I've done says this should work fine. Um, but, you know, we'll see. Um, so, yeah. All right. Franken PC. I guess there's really only one thing to do left is to see if it turns on. She done. She purdy. Until I get that switch, I have to ask, have it facing like the wrong way. Oh yeah, she bastardized. The cats are making a muck downstairs. I don't know if you can hear that. Oh! What, Steve's graphics card? No, uh, oh. I know I know what he has. It's just, uh, I'm playing GTA and I got, I ran into another car. Oh, more about PCI on a... 4X. Yeah, I mean, this, this, this motherboard was the one I used originally to start streaming. So, all this stuff should theoretically work fine. Yeah, after the new year, I'm going to start actually looking at those, um... Those channels again. Ah, there we go. All right. Oh wait! I found the front panel. It was just in a box under my desk. I think it was cooler without it though. So you know, just screw that. All right. Um, bear with me a second here. I'm going to be standing up a bunch. <laughs> Goodbye, monitor. It was nice knowing you. If everything goes well, you'll never be plugged into this PC ever again. Which one was it again? I really need to get better cable management. I guess I could just like. Hi! This is the kind of content you guys came here for, right? Nerd works on PC. Somewhere over here. Is this really gonna be with the bane of my existence? Son of a bitch. No! <laughs> hmm. I can figure this out. I had a 10, 1080. I got a 1070 still. That's what I stream on. Did my stream quality go to shit? Looks all fuzzy on my dashboard. It looks fine to me. Oh, it looks fine. I think it's just I moved the mod. I, 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 I had to move the monitors and stuff. <sighs> yeah.
Is the 5900X, is that an AMD card? Was the GPU marked up, though? Nice. Oh, it's a tie. Okay. How much are ties MSRP? I know normal ties are like. Well, no, I know normal 3800s are 700 MSRP. Which, like, when they first announced that, like, two years ago, or a year and a half ago, or whenever the hell they released it, it was like. Really? That's like. That was pretty cheap. Oh, if true, that's not bad then. $30 over? And there's some people paying like $1,000 over right now. Stupid people. But they're doing it. Uh-oh. Hmm. Oh, we're good. What? Oh, you playing a game? Yeah, I uh, almost ended up in the military base by complete accident. What are you playing? What are you playing? Grand Theft Auto 5. Oh, I didn't hear you. Excuse me. Oh, wait, hold on. This is working. Come on. Hey, you bitch. Ugh. Hey, we got lights. And the question is if I stay on the desk. cables yeah this is my yeah perfect ah I haven't standed in this desk and stood why I keep saying standard what's wrong with me Star Trek. <laughs> I'm just doing a test to make sure nothing's getting pinched or tugged too hard. Alright, awesome. So, pick you guys up again. <sighs> Hello. That's very close. It's very close to my face. Very close, very personal. Oh, now you're down there. Hello. This is awkward. Maybe I should take you out to dinner first. Ah! Everything's fucked. <laughs> so, as I was saying earlier, a little bit of ghetto, ghetto rigging or Frankensteining going on, like true Frankensteining. Um, get out of here. So, there are a couple um, ports that don't work. So,. Like I was explaining earlier, there are these pins here. And essentially, if I jump two of them with a metal object, the computer should turn on. Really? Don't fuck with me, computer. Well, actually, before I do this, I really should. <laughs> Kelso, I told you I had to do some weird shit to get this to work. Don't judge me. Thank you, hold on. This worked with these pliers earlier. I shit you not, I'm not crazy. I 
swear this wasn't some sort of fever dream I had. This worked. Yes, this is the fix. It worked the other day, I swear to God. Oh, I actually was playing it. Wisconsin right now? Apparently it's a tight one. Ryan? What? You hear about this? I actually was playing Wisconsin on the Big Ten board network right now? Yeah. And they're, it's a close one? Uh, I don't know what the score is. I swear this worked. I swear to you. I swear to me. That Wisconsin ISU See. score is gonna See. get my anxiety up. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Hilarious. Just never turn off your computer. <laughs> no, they're, uh, they 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 sell like little switches on Amazon for like super super cheap. Uh. Hilarious. Um. Keyboard, just Amazon, or not, I don't know where Christine got this. Chris got me this like in college forever ago. I'm not just gonna plug this bad boy in. Nothing fancy. Cool, it detects the drive. And then I've got a Republic of Gaming mouse. bio setup Ooh, look at that i remember this it was exciting look at that mm -hmm. real real fancy shit right there real fancy screwdriver technique there kev what the fuck am i doing eh. that's pretty poggy woggy bro It's an Intel 55, it's an Intel 6600K. Runs at 3.5 gigahertz. We got an open air concept to help cool it. We're gonna save and exit. Which hopefully just there's only one drive in there that it can boot to my USB 
So it should boot to the USB. Which is conveniently awaiting Windows setup. And I think, I think, because, hey, there it goes, it's booting in Windows. Because, um, I, I think most of the time Windows, like, they gets its licensing information from the motherboard. So hopefully it should just see the Windows license that was on there previously. And it should hopefully just activate. Um, if not, I'll have to buy Windows again, which will kind of suck, but... What's another hundred dollars? All right. Yeah, so now I guess we can just chill. Oh no, it needs a product key. It's a big old F in the chat. Oh, if you're reinstalling Windows, select I don't have a product key. Your copy of Windows will be act automatically activated later. Cool. I want Windows Home. I accept. Install Windows and keep files. Terabyte. Install. Cool. So we're installing Windows now. Yay! So thanks again, Ryan, for uh, the capture card. Now I just have to decide, am I gonna... Well, no, because I need the... I'll probably plug Christine's stuff into the capture card. Because their computer's the farther one away. And the capture card's got some, it's got some reach to it. So that's why we're the plan. We got an air fryer for Christmas. Um, we used it to reheat pizza last night and tonight. Um, I'm never reheating pizza any other way again. It's like top tier, like, like it, the cheese is all melty and shit, and the crust is like soft and flaky again. It's some good stuff. Are you, how, are you fucking kidding me? How do I migrate? I need to install OBS over on the other computer. How do I migrate? Migrate OBS settings. If only there was some device that could tell me how to do it. Prostrat, get a pizza and then let it get cold just so you can air fry <laughs> it. Genius. Why did I never think of it? sucks I don't want to reset up my file paths the same exact way
scene collection. Ex can I export midstream? Maybe. I can't export them in because I don't have the USB. God damn it. Theoretically, it should work. Thermoretically. So as you buy your pizza in the morning when they first open, if you want it for dinner, you just let it sit out all day. I think you're on to a, like a new strategy. You should just open up a pizza shop and call it Air Pizza. And all you do is you go and you buy your competitor's pizzas and you just let them sit out all day. And then you air fry them when people want them and you charge them an extra like buck or two. Boom. Profit. <laughs> Oh, that was a tree. Scratch off that bit of the box that says <laughs> not for resale. Uh, thanks, Kelso. Talk to you tomorrow, probably. Hey, Windows setup screen. Oh, damn. Minute to go, we're down by three. Yeah, like I said, it's going to get my anxiety up, so I'm not going to look until the game's over. Alright, let's set up windows real quick. You guys want to hang out while I set up windows? I live in the United States. Just a moment. Just a moment while we make fun of you. <laughs> Plugging in internet probably would help. Maybe. <laughs> Who needs that though? I do. I'll be right back. Good thing I had one open port left. I might have had to buy a networking switch. Oh, the humanity! Skip keyboard layout. Just a moment.
Add your account. my goddamn Microsoft account. Hmm. That worked. Hello, little bee popper. Can't see him swimming around. Create pin. Ugh. Just let me create a local account, for the love of God. Turn all that shit off. Find my device? Yeah, it's right here. <laughs> oh, what the hell? Skip. No, do not add my phone to my PC. What is all this crap? Float, where, kinda. <clears throat> you garbage. Oh my god. A free trial of Officer 65. No thanks. Don't need it. Let Cortana do blah blah. Not now. Oh no, the creepiest message in all windows. Hi. We're getting everything ready for you. This might take several minutes. Mmm. Several minutes. Oh. You better hold on tight, baby. Don't you and, think about turning and taken down? <laughs> Do we win? What? What? No, I. I oh, was you mean the stream? Yeah. <laughs> oh. I was responding to uh, what my, you were doing. My my slander to Microsoft's creepy ass error message or startup message. This might take several minutes. Do not turn off your PC. Don't even think about it. You naughty boy. Don't think about turning off your PC. Drain pipe next to the staircase. Come on. Oh. Almost there. <laughs> uh, oh, shit. My wallpaper. What? Are wallpapers stored on the motherboard? Uh, they're linked to your Microsoft account. Ow. Oh. Oh. That's kind of cool. A little stupid, but kind of cool. Hey, boyo. You set up. Let's open up Microsoft Edge. Welcome to Microsoft Edge. Check it out. We're the new Edge. We're cool. Complete set. Check it out. Check it out. Uh, browse to Google.com. Google recommends using Chrome. Do you want to download? Yes. <laughs> Do 
download Chrome. Open file. Wallpapers are stored on the motherboard has the same energy as views stored in the falls. <laughs> oh, why do I love that so much? That's so fucking funny. Oh, I, I, I my so the the new PC is not set up with the time and date yet. So it's like, it's set up with a date, but it says it's 7.15. So it's like, damn, I'm making great time. Nope. Alright, close that shit. Unpin that shit. Cool. Let's make sure all my RAM is reading. 16 gigabytes of RAM. Yep, 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 yep. Everything looks good. For a little... Itty bitty Frankenstein machine. It's running pretty freaking good right now. Um, it's all OBS. We're just gonna we're just gonna do this right now. We're just gonna keep setting it up. Let's go. Which means I will have to pause stream for a bit as I like you know actually switch over to the new computer. Um, but we'll cross that bridge when we get there. Who knows? Maybe we can all set up my, we can all set up my scenes together. <laughs> That'd be really fun stream content. Oh no! Wait, shit! I don't want. I need a uh... stream elements OBS download. That's what I need. The ultimate plugin. Did it actually find the Windows key? Is Windows licensed? That's amazing. Link to the license to my Microsoft account. Fuck yeah. Oh wait, let me make sure that I mean that didn't unlicense my main computer. Hold on. That'd be a big fucky wucky. Nope, we're good. We're good. Welcome to Stream Elements. Because it installs OBS for me. Which is nice. Then Ness! Where about my goddamn screwdriver? I always lose my screwdrivers. I don't know where on earth that thing could have gone. Check a little bugger. Hmm. I wonder, does the uh Are we working already? Yeah we are. Making sure that the PCI USB extenders work, and they do. It's good. It's all good. Oh, that's right. I can use this mouse now. That is gonna be taking some getting used to having to like use a different keyboard and mouse for stream stuff. That's gonna take a few weeks to get used to, I think. Damn. Yep.
That probably wasn't supposed to be a close game, though, was it? No, it wasn't. Wisconsin was 10-2 and two in the Big Ten. We're 8-6. Yeah. and six. There, Wisconsin is also ranked. <laughs> Could you imagine if they would have lost to us? That would have been, like, embarrassing. Badger, Badger fans would have rather have that game been canceled if that, were, if that happened. Oh, yeah. That's a little embarrassing, don't you think? I mean, I think that's applicable to most teams that lose any game. You gotta be shitting me. Motherfucker. The things I do for stream. Now, if only I knew which one was input and which one was output. There we go. 50 fishly shot, right? Need a token. Please remember my computer for the next 30 days. Dear God, do not ask me in 30 days. Authorize. I give you authority. Hey, Google, did you just fucking sign in? <laughs> We're shutting down all of your accounts right now. Oh, it was you. Okay. <laughs> you still have to change all your passwords. Mm -hmm. But hey, we protected you. We're not fucking around this time. <clears throat> okay, I'll be more careful. You'll be dead! Okay, OBS is setting up. Some good shit over there. Ugh. So here's gonna be the weird thing is, it's gonna look for my... Can look for my sources, but my sources are on like a secondary drive. So do I need to make a secondary drive? Hey, Steve. I'd have to. This is where all the. That's like the path. 
Maybe it won't look to the drive letter? Should I just create a, like a, a 10 megabyte partition? <laughs> Bless you! Okay, so OBS is banned with testing right now. I'm actually very thirsty, so I'm going to step away and get another drink, let OBS finish setting up. Um, I will be right back with stream. Um, I'm not ending right now, I'm going to be right back because i got to get some other stuff set up. Um, so, yeah, I will be right back.
skal lave. That's interesting. The auto configure wizard still says testing. Hey, Monica. Hmm. Not responding. There we go. I wonder if it doesn't like it because it's trying to do a bandwidth test and I'm like, you know, oh, I just got back from making myself a drink. Thank you. Because I'm also streaming right now. It's like, yo fam, you can't handle this. But I'm over here like, yeah, bro, I can handle this. Gone. Thought? Like the whole news and weather little button. Look at this cute little thing we got. It's all, it's hard to see. Oh, there we go. Rainbow. It's very cute. Oh, yeah, we're just in Discord what? if you guys are bored. So it's just the light? Yeah. It's got like a four hour timer or something. We got that when we were with Jess in the Dells. Wisconsin is the Badgers, right? Ryan? Huh? Wisconsin's the Badgers, right? Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. Hi okay. Okay. and bye, Monica. Oh, is Monica here? Nope, not anymore. Oh. stream PC. Give me that token.
No! Fuck! Sorry. That's cool, I can see the chat still. Oh, cool, that works. with it. Monica, look at these puffer fish. They're very cute. I'm able to come through the glass. Hold on. Hello? Oh, there's one. Hi, little buddy. They're like little puppies. Real blurry. No wait. Where do you go? It's super blurry. Anyways. Whoa! Oh god. Hello. Uh, the new stream PC setup, um, there she is, um, just trying to get OBS set up right now. I call it my Frankenstein's computer. Missing files. So... Assuming I can just go and copy those files. <laughs> App data. Shit, what were they? Show me the path. Roaming slobs. Slob sounds dirty. Like it's like a sloppy thing. You know? Slobs. Clients. Overlays. Kinetic purple. Probably just take the entire folder, right? I'm just gonna take the entire slobs client folder, actually. Fuck it, right? I need to put put the USB stick back over there 
Copy. Best. It's besting. Oh, Ryan, I just realized you're getting a really nice view of my chin. There you go. Jesus. This might take a few minutes. Oh, you want an antique barber chair from 1926? What? Some local place is selling it for $1,200. Well, you know, only. I mean, it's a fully functional, like, barber chair with, like, hydraulics and shit. I'm getting my beard trimmed, actually, tomorrow. It'll look real nice. <sighs> Made a mistake. Well, I'm waiting for files to transfer right now. How's everyone in chat doing? Having a good night? Having a having a good time so far? can't decide if I want to So I guess the question is, how do I capture audio, and how do I listen to the audio? First, a little rough on the edges, so I'm decompressing. Oh, nice. I should really play more Animal Crossing. Hmm. Let's look this up while we're waiting. Dual PC audio setup. Thanks, Pizza Parker. It's pizza time.
Is this copy job done yet? 27%? What the fuck? I guess they are like video sources and stuff. Hmm. Okay. Ah. Okay. I've actually already got the software I need for it. I've already got voice meter banana, that's nice. Oh, okay, I need to install pretzel. Well, that means I won't hear my sick pretzel beats anymore. God damn it. Mike is not having a good time. No, yeah, I saw that Twitter thread and I was like, oof. Okay. So as soon as I get my things set up, my overlays, I'm gonna have to switch my stream deck. to the stream PC. You should probably download that software. Mm, and probably the cap. Oh. Shit, did I say it was at 60 Pro? HD 60 Pro. Yeah. Uh, Mike was just ranting about the cat his sister brought home. Install this software while we wait. Essentially, Mike was trying to be irresponsible. Cat is very needy, apparently. I mean, we heard the cat yesterday at the end of the stream. I mean, Mike was trying to be a responsible pet owner and not, like, you know, take on pets he can't handle right now. 
other people in his household decided otherwise, and now, unfortunately, he has to pay the price. Not pay the price, but you know what I mean. This is, again, going to be very weird having two keyboards and mice that I actively need to use. I'm not ready for this kind of responsibility. God damn, what's this transfer at? 55%? Why so slow? It's because all the micro assets and stuff, I bet. Okay. Um, move stream deck to new computer. Is there anybody to do this? With great power comes a great responsibility, or managing keyboards. Back up and restore profiles, that's what I want. Yep, baby. Wait, which profile am I on? Oh, I'm just on default, okay. So if I go to profiles, default. Back up, create backup. That's it. Really? Oh, it's beautiful. It's going to be so easy. Just like me. What? You played Red Dead One, right? Uh, yes. Was Bigfoot in the normal game? Yes. Okay. Just because, like, apparently there's a lion in the game. Like, I, I killed the lion. Already. Actually, well, yeah, he was, but it was in Undead Nightmare. Oh, okay, that's different then. I mean, it's still uh, Red Dead One. True. I want. So in Red Dead 2, right, mm -hmm. there's this female you meet at the very beginning of the game. You a girl? Well, you actually save her. Her name's Sadie. Okay. Yeah. Um, oh, okay. Oh, my God. What? Do you know about her? No. It's just, I heard Sadie and... Oh, like, yeah. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Um, her name's Sadie, and um, you, you, you save... It's like the very first mission you do. Um, and then she becomes a member of the gang. And then essentially, she very quickly becomes, I ain't no, like, normal female. Like, I ain't no housewife. Like, like I share the work. I want to go out there with you guys. And she becomes, like, this outlaw with you. And she's on, like, these missions and stuff. And she becomes this badass. And, like, the game ends. And I actually looked her up on the wiki. And, like, there is no end to her story. So I have a feeling if there's going to be a Red Dead 3, it's going to be about her. Either that, or I want, like, a DLC side game, like, Undead Nightmare about her or something. I just want another Undead Nightmare. That shit was fun. I don't know why they haven't done that yet. Maybe because Red Dead Online was such a big hit? I don't know. That's a, that, that's a series, though, that I will keep following, though. Red Dead... 
I'm having so much fun with Red Dead 1, or Red Dead 2. Like, even just, like, I saved a guy from a bear trap, like, a couple days ago. And yes, last night I'm playing, and I'm just in this town. And he was like, hey, hey there, mister. And he's like, thanks again for, like, helping me out. Like, I didn't get to thank you properly. Like, go into the general store here and pick out anything you want. It's on me. And I, like, went in and I bought, like, a nice silver pocket watch. It was free. Because the guy bought it for me. <laughs> but it's, it's just the, the, those, those kind of small little world interactions that I'm like, that's so cool. download done yet god damn what do you want to talk about oh how's uh how are things that's good mm -mm. yeah me too yep Need to fix the date and time. It's throwing me off. This is 9:57 or 7:57. That's not right. Bah, 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 bah. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, that's why this was negative eight. Silly goose. You're in Central Time. This sports shit poster. Um, does a recap of all the NFL games over the weekend. Mm -hmm. um, and he usually has, like, if a team gets eliminated from playoff contention or makes the playoffs, like, has, like, a graphic for that. It, uh, last year's team was Among Us. This year is uh, Squid Games. Really? Yeah, so when one person dies in Squid Games, he just puts, like, the team's logo over their face and say that they got eliminated. <laughs> And any time uh, a team clinches a playoff spot, it's just the, the clip of the money going into the piggy bank. Eighty-five percent. We're almost done. <sighs> we're filling up our saltwater tank tomorrow. That'll be fun. Should I watch Demon Slayer, Ryan? Yes. Is it good? Yes. Is it dubbed anywhere? Probably. Where's that? Mike guy when I need him. Demon Slayer. And then and then God. read it. Oh really? Yeah. Uh, season two just started, right? Yeah, I'm waiting for it to like fully be done so that I can just watch it all at once. Okay. I'm also curious as to where season two is gonna end. That's fair. I'm I'm still upset that my hero's ending next year. Oh. Demon Slayer dub is on Funimation. Perfect. The manga is also done. Oh really? Yeah. I think it finished uh this year, at least being translated and sold and shit. But I was curious as to where season two would would end because there's just a bunch of training arcs, and if they do a final season, like you start with training arcs. Yeah. That'd be a I mean, there's yeah, it would. It's been be, done would before, be kinda, I think. Yeah, it would be kind of weird, but like, there's no other way to like lead up to like the the like the the end actual ending. 
Mm -hmm. The fuck? Restore from backup. There we go. Okay, now I can... Easier if I actually stand up my desk. Arise. What's wrong button? Arise. Arise, chicken. Oh, arise, I can't. Chicken. Wait, I can't quote that guy anymore. Chicken arise, why not? Well, I was quoting AH member that shall not be named, but I realized they must have been quoting uh, Aqua Teen Hunger Force. That was a, that was a him thing? Yeah. You sure? Yep. The rice chicken? Yeah, he quoted that. Oh. I always thought that was Michael. Okay. There we go. That's the cord. Oh, I've heard good things about Fire Force. I'm gonna watch that. I have that on my watch list. Oh, it's just the entire slobs, right? Yes. Copy. Rolling slobs. Oh, great. Now I can wait for it to copy. Which is going to take just as long. This is fine. It's actually copying much faster than it was. Ooh, episode 22. That's pretty far. Is Fire Force 24 or 26 episodes? Monica. What a good question, Ryan. Good question indeed. I would look it up myself, but I'm bored. <laughs> but I'm too lazy.
24 per season. I on Varv. There we go. I'm near the end of reading part three of JoJo's. What tool was that that I was using? I'm going to wait for part six to finish airing before I uh, start watching like just just about with anything that I watch except the uh, Pride of Orange because, you know, hockey. Uh, surprisingly, uh, hockey fans do not like Pride of Orange. Really? Yeah. That's kind of surprising. Or is it? I mean, in general, I think it has like a six on Mal. And Mal classifies that as fine. Fine. I'm or halfway. Fine. Th I'm, I'm only halfway through it. Um, probably going to catch up at some point this weekend. Um,. So I'll have a better opinion on it. To me, it's just like a generic sports anime so far. And they just started the idol stuff. Oh, there we go. So that guy does run that? Oh. Yes, please. Install that shit. A lot of switching this USB stick back and forth between my two computers. I'll tell you that much. There's porn of that. I don't like you, Ryan. I was 100% joking, Ryan. <laughs> I was going to say, is that why you picked me as part as part of your group's party? Yeah, and but I'm a hundred percent positive. I told you you were co-best man. I'm like hundred percent positive. <laughs> well, I know I told my brother for sure. He knew, <laughs> and he was the one I was most worried about about that.
I really need to start watching JoJo. Alright, alright, you know my taste. You think I like JoJo? Yeah. I I think so. You got a folder called Deck Files. Not I mean, you watch you watch My Hero Academia with that's that has superpowers. JoJo has superpowers. <laughs> again I like that's not opening. Why aren't you opening? Congrats, Ryan. That picture of you on the bow of the ship is apparently in a. <laughs> is it cycle? Yeah. What do you mean it's not there? I guess I can skip some of those for now. Let's see here. If I go to couple play. Okay, so I need that back. I think just for right now, I'm just going to get the bare minimum set up. Just so I can do my test tonight. Just because it is getting a little late. You know? Hello, testing, testing. 
Sorry, this is gonna be a. Actually, I'm gonna mute myself real quick in that. Hold on. Hello. Okay. Uh, am I double talking right now or anything? Monica, in if you're still there, please tell me you're still there. Let me know if I'm double talking. Or if you can like hear me twice or something. Uh I just checked you are not double talking. Yes. Okay. Whew, okay. First row dog. Okay. I need to grab the Danny gif. Save the entire Christine artwork folder and put it on my USB. Please don't be that big. Okay, go quick. Good. Bump, bump, bump. Hold on, I'll be right back. Listen to the purr. <laughs> you sure you're not doing yard work? Bye bye. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's a he's a lot of purr.
Boom! Okay, well, Chris's PC is being captured by the stream PC now. He's, he's a loud purr. Um. Okay, so I guess really the next step is switching over. Um. Yeah, so I guess I'm gonna, um. Guess I'm gonna end my stream for the last time on this computer. It's. Hopefully. Um. So yeah, I'll, uh. I think I know what I'm doing. Um. That sounds really reinforceful. Um, yeah, so I'm going to end the stream here, um, and I will be back in hopefully just a few minutes in a little bit. Um, so, yeah, so I'll see you guys in a little bit. Stay tuned. We'll be back with some testing. Um, if you guys want to hang out, feel free to just chill. Um, but I do have to end the stream completely in order to switch out everything and switch over to the new computer. Um so yeah, so I'll be back in a little bit. Um, bye.